Hey everyone, I'm back with another video and because I am a little bit late with all the Beery Christmas ones we're gonna start with number 11 who was actually from yesterday uh, it also serves best at 6 to 8 degrees and it goes really well with aged cheese so I've got the, bo the bottles with me I've just got uh, this one of the, bot of the box and let's get it into a glass it's uh, a blonde one, it's the Hirond Ale from Brasserie Dupont and it comes in at 6% ABV. Okay, let's get it in a glass. It surely is a blonde. I was also thinking it could be a Pilsner in style, but it seems really a blonde one. There's some great carbonation going on, look at this. Can see it bubbling away. I can see it bubbling away anyway. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Let's try this. Real spicy on the nose. Could be even a pilsner. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna tell you when I have it actually. But like six, like six uh, ABV, six percent ABV. I think this will be just a blonde. But some more spicy then for sure. Okay, guys. Let's taste it. Cheers. Yeah, it's a blood and really lemony like some coriander in there but also really smooth drinking refreshing yeah it has some some kind of notes like a wheat beer like the lemony thing you get the citrusy and the coriander in there okay so a really nice beer I'm gonna give this let's say six and a half out of ten this one from Dupont. Now, because because I was late, to, today we have the number 12, of course. Also served best 6 to 8 degrees Celsius. And it goes really well with duck breast. This, so that's the food that compares, compares best with it. That's the duck breast. And it's a can, actually, from Camden Brewery, the Lager. The Bock Lager and it comes in at 6.5% ABV. Okay, let's get the can open and let's get it in a glass. Like I was expecting, brown ish in color. I'm gonna take a look in the light a little bit more. Yeah, it's uh, some ruby red shine to it. It has a red, the light, when the light's coming through, you can see the red in there, but it's dark brown with a reddish uh, hint to it. Let's say it like that. Okay, let's get the nose. Mm, really malty. Malty, some chocolate, maybe some coffee. I'm gonna look look at the uh, on the can for the ingredients. Hops and dark malts. Yeah, so the dark malts can be that coffee hints you get. Yeah. Okay. Let's give it a taste. Cheers. Yeah, vanilla, I get a lot of vanilla, chocolate, some coffee notes, but that could be the roasted malts, the dark malts I was talking about for the ingredients. It also has a hoppy, refreshing feel to it, like it's smooth drinking. It is thick, so creamy, it sticks to your palate. Really nice in taste. So this for me is maybe even more, if I have to give it some a rating or points. Let's say this one is for me 7 to 7.5 seven out of 10. So that was our number 12 from our Beery Christmas. 
and tomorrow of course number 13 because I was behind so I got to do this time two at once I'm gonna show you again the 11 and the 12 the doors I broke off from our beer Christmas box so okay till tomorrow guys cheers and don't forget a beer day keeps the doctor away bye